Hi guys and welcome to part 15 of Angular with Firebase application tutorials. And on this part we are going to create our service which is going to interact with our Firebase database. We are going to put our service on a separate folder. So for that on the app folder create a new folder named services. We are going to create this service using the Angular CLI. So for that right click and open in terminal. Here we are going to write ng generate or short g a service the name is going to be firebase press enter so we see that our service was created but to use it we need to configure it so for that let's go to our app.module.ts file and in here just write service we need to import it and you can find it on services firebase.service you need to use this providers array so here just write the name of the service which is the firebase service and save the changes. Now go back to our firebase.service.ts and here you are going to see the injectable decorator. It means that we can import this class in any of the components and inject it in our constructor and use its methods to interact with the data in the firebase database. Just like we have done in here with our angular fire database. Now, this service is going to interact with the Firebase database, so we need to make all the necessary changes in here. Since we are going to use this service to interact with our Firebase database, we need to make the necessary imports. So we are going to first import Angular Fire database and Firebase list observable. Now to use the Angular Fire database, just like in our books component, write in here private DB Angular Fire database. To get all the books from the Firebase database, we are going to create a new function. Let's write in here get books. This is a function, so we open curly brackets in here. And you are going to see that this.books, where books is just a variable that we have declared up in here. It's a Firebase observable list. So we write in here this.books is equal to this.db.get the list of the books as Firebase list observable any. This method is going to return this.books. So this is all you need to do in your service. Now let's go back to our books component and here make the necessary changes. Now we don't need this import in here anymore. So, so instead of that one, let us just import our service, the Firebase service that we just created and remove this one from here, remove the injection and everything else. Inside our constructor, we need to inject our service. So for that we write private Firebase service, Firebase service. And inside here we are going to use our new injection to get all the books. So for that we write in here this dot Firebase service dot get books. This is an observable so we can subscribe to this one. And we can subscribe by writing subscribe. As a result from the subscribe we are going to get some books. And in here let's write this dot all books are equal to books. So let's save the changes. Go to your books.component.html. Just leave the second ng4 directive. Save the changes and go to your application. You're going to see that we get all the books. But now we don't get these books by using the injection of Firebase in here. We created our service and we injected our service to get the books for us. So guys, this is all for this part. Thank you for watching and see you on the next one.